Alright, I'm going to show you guys how to catch some crayfish, or crawdads, as they call them down south. Um, pretty easy, pretty good thing to do, rusty crayfish, get them out of the lakes and rivers because they're an invasive species, and they taste really good. So, step number one, get some bait. Crawfish bait. Alright, so once you got your bait, the next thing you want to do is uh, chop it up in some way just so it gives off more smell. Now, I like to take the bluegills I catch and at least clean them, um, even though they're small, it just makes me feel better about killing a fish. The whole thing's not going to waste, I'm still taking the meat off of it and then using the cut. Still, though, and uh, some of them. The really small ones, getting clean all of them. So that's where taking it, a hatchet, and just you know, just cut them in half, just to get that smell out. The crayfish are gonna smell that. Here's as good as any. Good luck, crab trap. Alright, now it's the fun part. Time to check them. Woohoo! A little better. I see a big one in there though. Well, yeah. Alright, hopefully this one's got it. Come on. Oh no! Pretty much your only chance is to hope that the net hooks on it or something. Got it? Nice. Good job. Alright, here we are. We're gonna go pick up the traps. Hopefully we have a lot. Alright, you see the float? That's what we gotta go get, so here I'll Oh, that's a dead one. That's gross. Probably could, but... William caught the smallest crayfish in the world. <laughs> That's cool. You can't even pinch you. Right there. Okay, we have to do this very carefully. Don't pull it hard. Just easy. Easy. Nice. Nice. <laughs> First cast with that thing. Oh, one fell in. Try to grab him. this trap yesterday because it was way down there and I brought this I grappling hook. Good job, go put him in there. Brought this grappling hook, pulled it back in. Well worth the aisle. Saved the trap and got a lot of crayfish. That's in there. Right here. That's the biggest one I think. Oh that no. Is. Oh, there's a chubby one. Really? Yeah, it's right here. Nice. That's how, awesome. How can they not get out? Well, 
Well, because they go in this side and then they can't figure out how to get out. Oh. It's perfect. Yeah, they're probably not the smartest creatures. Are you glad that I grabbed that? Alright, do you want, want me to let you shake these in? Think you can do it? Maybe. So what you're going to do is, the, it's open, and you just yeah, I know. shake them in, alright? These things are going back. Now if any fall, it's okay, you can just pick them up. Got it? I have a good feeling about this one. Big one? Wow, that's awesome. All right. So close. It's gonna be hard walking back with this, William. Um, sure. Alright, here's the third one. I had to cross the other side. This one should be good, though. You got a good feeling about this one. What? I hardly caught any in this one. Really? Heavy, huh? Ooh, I bet we can snag it on the way back. I sure did, alright. Pull it in. Feels heavy? Oh, baby. I see a lot of crayfish in there, bud. Alright, grab it. Grab the actual trap part. Pretty good. I'd say that's pretty good. And then we could see them all on the top. I gotta wind this up. That's a good. That's a good pull right there. That's a. a isn't crayfish trapping fun? It's easy too. And they taste good. That's the best part. goes right in there without him getting out. Uh oh. No, I lost one. I see him. Yeah, I see him still. Got a crayfish, bud. Good job. You happy? These are all rusties with the spot there. What you're going to do is hold them by the tail, and then lift up that shell, and that pulls right out. Now this part, it's all the gross guts. You can see they're nasty in there. That's garbage. Right here, now what you got is you have the crayfish, 
all those guts are gone. And the one last step is to take this middle fin. See there's five? Take the middle one, oops, only the middle one, and twist it, and that pulls out the poop line. Now you are good to go. Nice done crayfish.